As I, I was telling our viewers, uh, Darren Wilson has done an interview, I believe today, with, uh, with George Stephanopoulos on ABC. We just got an excerpt of that. I just want to play that. We can talk about it. Let's watch. I asked him directly, did he shoot towards Michael Brown's back? He said no. He said Michael Brown reached into, into his car, grabbed for his gun, and that's why he feared for his life. He also said that later when Michael Brown left the car, he actually charged toward Officer Wilson, did not raise his hands in surrender, and that's why Officer Wilson said he had to shoot Michael Brown on that day. Well, he did say he was sorry for the loss of life, uh, the loss of Michael Brown's life. He said he would not do anything different that day, that he did what he was trained to do. He was simply doing his job. And they will obviously be playing more and we'll be able to broadcast it when they do. Um, it, I mean, I, I do think it's interesting that Darren Wilson deciding to speak out and wanting to speak out. Um, he obviously held meetings that was reported with a number of reporters. I was one of them. Uh, they, it was in a, off the record what was discussed, but it was basically seeing, it, I, I asked him basically if he wanted to do an interview and he didn't choose me, he chose uh, Stephanopoulos. Do you think it's wise for him to speak? I, I think so. Uh, it's wise for him to speak because we haven't heard from him, right? And what you don't want is someone else to write your own narrative. So it's good to get in front and try and get as much as your story out there, even though we have you know, his, his testimony, you know, many of us aren't going to read all those pages. So we will watch the interview to try to hear his side of the story and to get a sense of what the grand jury may have heard from him. But just in that brief excerpt, you can understand why so many African Americans in particular are upset. Because what we know, the way that we teach our black boys to interact with the police officers, just isn't consistent with what that testimony and what he is telling George Stephanopoulos right there. Charging at bullets being sprayed at you just isn't something that as a black dad I taught my son. It's also interesting because if you read Read uh, Wilson's testimony, which I have read a, a good deal of it, mm -hmm. uh, especially about that initial encounter. According to Wilson, the encounter was almost hostile on Michael Brown's part right. from the get-go, unilaterally, according to Officer Wilson. So again, uh, people should read it and make up their own minds.